Hey everyone, it's John from Six Pack to Six Pack here, coming at you with day two of our small batch dispatch 24 beer day advent calendar. That smile is too weird, isn't it? It's like a, it's like a serial killer smile. <laughs> day two, we have Anderson Craft Ales, Raspberry Fruit Sour, very awesome, very awesome stuff. Shout out to Small Batch Dispatch for this calendar. This is actually my first beer advent calendar um, of life, uh, which is absolutely awesome. Oh, that sounds good. And uh, really excited to, uh, to be sampling these beers. Another mix up, so we have the Anderson uh, Raspberry Fruit Sour going in the Flying Monkeys uh, to the glass. Pouring your beer correctly today. Give an ass. Good, nice. Maybe not too correctly, it was a bit soft. Give it a nice little bit of head. That looks beautiful. Sours are like the it beer right now. And um, I think it was IPA's turn before, sours. Uh, I'm not sure what's next, but I do have a theory um, that we're headed into blend territory. Not like beer, cocktails, that type of shit. No, but different types of beer, different uh, blends, and even different uh, just profiles of the beer. I think that's that's the next thing to come down. Uh, if it's not, I didn't say this. But we're gonna get right to it. It's uh, again Anderson Craft Ales Raspberry Fruit Sour. This is day two. Ooh, sours are like just remind me of those uh, what do they call warheads? You know, those really sour candies. And I like styles like this one are nice. They have enough bite off the top, especially in the sour, um, that it's not too entry level. Um, it's got enough carbonation behind it and it's got enough um, sourness behind it. Uh, not, not bad, not bad at all. Shout out to Anderson for this one. Um, very good, again, jumping on the sour bandwagon over the last year. Now, drum roll please. Insert fake drum roll. <laughs> I would, uh, I would definitely, uh, I would definitely have this again. So therefore, it enters in the, uh, <laughs> enters in that three to four range. I would rate this a three point five. Um, definitely would, would seek it out. Definitely would, would go for it on a beer menu. So I'd like to see a little more combination in, in styles like this. Um, and uh, but overall, really good. Um, from uh, Anderson and uh, brewed in uh, London, Ontario. Um, shout out to the uh, to the brewer staff there again for these ratings. It's literally I know nothing. I'm not a cicerone. Um, I'm no expert, uh, so it's just uh, just my own uh, my own two cents. Um, may not be worth anything, but it's uh, just giving a shout out to local craft breweries um, that have really been uh, struggling this year and really want to uh, elevate any local business. Um, if you have any local business that you want to shout out, please do it in the comments um, and let us know which uh, different types of breweries we should be trying. And maybe they're already in this calendar, who knows? Um, and uh, let us know your favorite brewery and we'll try to get to it um, as, as best we can. Really good, really good raspberry notes. Um, raspberry fruit sours, if, you, if you're not even a fan of eating raspberries, they're awesome. And uh, really just, really just a good, a good beer all around. That's up. Please stay tuned for day three. I'll let you know today because I did prepare. And no, I didn't, did I? Um, don't know what bears for tomorrow. We're just keeping it easy breezy here. Please put your comments in the uh, in the below section there. Like and uh, share this all around. Again, it's John from Six Pack to Six Pack. Have a great day, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow for day three of the six beers of Christmas. No, that's not what it is. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow for day three of six packs to six packs. I can't even speak. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow for day three of six pack to six packs review of small batch dispatch beer 24 day advent calendar. Cheers. Beauty. Absolute beauty. <laughs>